Hey guys, Big Daddy Hoffman 1911 coming to you today. I got little man Jack here with me. He's been running around here on the range, having a good time. So he's checking out these guns right here, these revolvers. What do you think, Jack? Yes, sir. Jack likes revolvers. So do I. All right, go play, Betty. All right, guys. I've got two you birdies here that I plan to do a video on. It's the 1873 Bird's Head Cattleman. As you well know, probably, I've already done a video on, on this one. It's a uh, 45 Cattleman. Uh, but this, these are 357s. And I do like the Bird's Head grip. I do like the blue finish, though, on the Cattleman. I've also got a Ruger Volcaro out here, and it's in a 45. Uh, I've had some, a lot of questions people asking me, well, you know, how do you like the Volcaro over the uh, Uberti or the Cimarron or, and you know, both of them are very fine revolvers. The action is smooth on all of them. And um, I can't say anything bad about any of them. I have some really sweet Ubertis. Uh The Cimarrons are great. They make some beautiful uh, replicas. and. And of course, you know, we all know the Volcaro. It's a very sweet revolver. So I think I don't think one could go wrong with either one of them. But the Ubertis come, come in a nice box here. And they're they're not priced too high. I mean you're looking at these around five hundred bucks. And you're looking at the uh, cattleman with the blue finish, you know, around five fifty probably. Um, and that'll vary. I don't know. They might have gone up since I bought these because I've had them a while. But the other day I was watching a video that Hickok 45 posted. And it, the name of the video was How Not to Shoot a Revolver. And I must say that he taught me something that I didn't know. I watch a, a lot of Hickok 45 videos. This is a great man and he's done so much for this shooting sport keeps his channel clean. I, ha I really admire him very much. A lot of people said, well, you're a spinoff of Hickok or you're trying to copy Hickok. Nobody can copy. <laughs> I can't even talk. Nobody can copy Hickok 45. I mean, the man has, he knows his stuff and he can shoot. He can shoot a whole lot better than I can. I can tell you that. But you know, I'm out here having fun, I'm, and we all have our own style. And uh, as you well know, mine is quite different. <laughs> I'm always saying a bunch of junk all the time and trying to entertain a little bit too. So, but anyway, Hickok 45 doesn't need a plug from Big Daddy Hoffman 1911. But I just wanted to let you know, you know, about this video, how not to shoot a revolver. You need to check out that video because you never need to put your thumb up here on a revolver when you're shooting it. So you crank this thing back, don't come up here like this because you've got the spacing between the cylinder and the barrel that Hickok was talking about. And I didn't know that it threw out that much um, stuff and it would do that much damage to you, but it can burn you. Um, and you know, it can hurt your eyes if you got somebody standing beside of you or whatever. So I would really suggest backing off, at least bring your thumb back here, get it out of the way, or don't even put it up there at all. But bring your thumb back. And uh, I mean, that was something that I should have known, but didn't. From watching that video, you're never too old to learn, especially from somebody like him. So look forward to the video on these little bird's heads right here. And I'll see, uh, maybe I'll find a bank robber to shoot or two. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I love these Western single action revolvers. Just can't beat them. Keep your thumbs away from the end of the cylinder and the barrel right here. And you'll have it made. Yeah. You know how I am. I'll probably come out here and just shoot them one-handed. Yeah, just like that. Crank them back and say, all right, cowboy. Drop them money bags from that bank. 
We're going to fire up these smoke wagons. That's right. <laughs> oh, okay. That's all I got to say. If you like this video, please like, favor, and subscribe. And remember, Big Daddy love you. whoopee Kai, ura See you guys. Thank you, Hickok45. I really appreciate you teaching me something. Something else. See you guys.